What is up, guys? Welcome back to some more Hypixel Skyblock. I've actually gotten good since last stream. Your boy has been grinding. You know, I watched back that video and it actually hurt to watch back because, man, did I struggle with tier fours. But as you can see, we're now 62 on the leaderboards. I was number 20. We've been slacking the last couple of days. We managed to grind all the way up to Ender Slayer level 7. I'm now at 144k XP. It's taken so long. I've been a little bit busy the past couple of days, so I haven't played as much as I would have liked to. But I've been able to play a fair amount. I literally had one of the days where I just grinded Endermen the entire day. And do you want to hear how much I'm suffering, chap? So first of all, I get pretty much everything I need to make the new bow, Terminator, which I'm sure you've all seen. It's cracked. I have everything minus the Judgment Core and a couple stacks of Enchanted Quartz, right? I was ready to just go ahead and make the bow instantly. I was ready to go and make it, and then they update the recipe. So instead of requiring six null atoms, it now requires this RNG Jesus drop, which is pain. It's crazy currently selling for around 800 mil on the auction house and I'm very, very broke. So I'm just trying to drop that. Let me show you these screenshots, chat, because it hurts. Crazy rare drop, exceedingly rare ender artifact upgrader. That was one of the first ones. Didn't sell it though because I wanted to keep it for myself. Crazy rare drop, pocket espresso machine, you know, we're vibing. Got another crazy rare drop. This is rare for me, dude. I don't get good drops. Then I got the Void Conqueror Enderman skin, which is cool. It's really cool, but I like the spooky skin. Unfortunately, that's just sitting in my inventory. And finally, just I dropped a blood chalice. So so I've dropped pretty much every single RNG Jesus drop except Ender Slayer 7 and the Judgment Core. It is agony. I want nothing more than the Terminator. I have almost everything for it. But instead, I just decided to buy all of the new items and just try them out. Everything except the Juju Bow, because the Juju Bow is basically the Terminator. So we're going to be trying those out this stream. Some of them are kind of cracked. Other ones are absolute hot garbage. Do you want to know what the biggest scam in Hypixel Skyblock is now, chat? The RNG Jesus meter for Enderman Slayer. It is a joke. If you ever get that to 100%, honestly, you'd have required therapy long before that. I think literally two T4 bosses is 0.1%. It is insane. There is no point in having an RNG Jesus meter for this Slayer. You just got to pray that the Hypixel gods are kind to you because nothing about this Slayer is generous in the slightest. It is nothing but pure agony. It ain't it. You know what I think I'm going to do for a limited time in the stream? Help me with the judgment core. I think what I'm going to do is full out, swavy style, sell out, fill my auction house. All the top bids will get a shout out next video. Video. Here are the names of all the rich Donnies who gave contraband this stream. In case you all didn't know, there is actually a new upgrade to the aspect of the end slash aspect of the void. So, you know, I made my aspect of the void last stream. I've gotten to like it a lot. At first, I was a bit kind of like, what is this? But I really like TPing with a spoon. I think it looks sick. I really, really enjoy using this. They actually release like a new drop that you can get called like the conduit or something like that. Ether warp conduit. And you need the ether warp merger as well once you're at level seven. And it adds an extra ability to your aspect of the end or aspect of the void that allows you to teleport 60 blocks if you sneak and right click. I mean, it costs like one soul flow, which isn't that much anymore, but it is weird. You can pull off some crazy stuff with it, but the way it works is strange. You kind of got to like look at the tip of the block you want to TP to and 60 blocks is a lot less than you'd think, but that's basically how it works. It is cool. It's satisfying to do, but it's a little bit buggy. It may or may not work in the floor seven boss room. It's pretty insane. And there's like new cheeses and stuff you can do with it in dungeons, just like finding secrets faster and stuff. It's nuts. We got to do some floor seven in a bit to show you chat because i'm enjoying this a lot oh this guy wasn't kidding that is goated right how do i make island ranks scarlet menu island management do you have any ranks bot how friendly dude select name terminator that's a threatening name dude i want it to be red i can't choose dark red red it'll have to be island rank and peace terminator there we go i'm such a boomer he's got it dude let's go it's been so long i genuinely feel disgusting just inviting people to my island and stealing all of their things i might have to go actually play the game a little bit shortly Legion 3, so I'll take it. And a mythic hill to... That actually looks clean. Interesting assortment. Thank you, Mr. 7Z1. I, I'm very grateful, my guy. <laughs> Are there even any judgment calls on the auction house? It's one that ends in an hour. That's this stream. The last few have sold for about 800 mil. We might have to auction some more things. I didn't realize there was one ended in an hour. Oh, I could make Terminator this stream. That could be juicy. Quartz is 150 mil a stack. Half. Oh, yeah. I'm going to need about like 1.3 billion, maybe. I need another fair amount of coins. And I'll probably get out bid because i'm streaming oh man oh it's it's pain buy quartz from builder and sell to refraction what if the entire stream did that that could actually be a vibe <laughs> but I, I don't think so chat would lose out on so much free money speaking of free money 200 
142 millers. Oh my God. I can't even press claim all because my rat court member Palika doesn't want to log in and claim his auctions. All right, bizarre mining quartz. It went from 150 mil to 160 mil to 180 mil. Oh my God. At least now we can get to making more parts of the Terminator. One, two, three. Null blade, null blade, and null blade. We're most of the way there with the craft now. We just need the judgment core. And we have all the enchants, by the way, chat, before you say anything. After all that contraband that paid off one of the enchanted stacks of quartz pl Holy, this thing is expensive. <laughs> Wait, this guy's cats are 44. Is it just showing my cat to level it? Right. I feel so bad doing it like almost immediately, but I am going to have to auction this Hyperion like straight away because if I want to bid on that judgment core, we need fundage, man. Where are we going? Five star. 500 mil. We'll go with 50. Oh, six, nine, six, nine, six, nine, six. Yeah, that, that's a good price. That's a, that's a pretty good price. We'll put it for two days, but you know, it's got to sell this stream when we're doomed. Watch this. We've just, we've just gone completely sold out in front of the entire stream. Got all of those coins. <gasps> Someone bought the Hyperion. Let's go, Shrek. Parging. Watch this. I've sold out like that. Got all of those things, all of those coins. And this boss drops a judgment core. But killing these with an E-Drag is so nice. They die so fast. I remember last video I said I never envisioned these things being easy. But I wouldn't say they're easy, but they're definitely like very doable. Like last stream, I was suffering, man. Want me to show you how to skip an entire dungeon, go straight to boss with new items? Skip an entire dungeon. Also, what? Why are you guys fighting this hard to be the biggest rat? So what I beat him? Oh my sweet Jesus. All these years of trying to get Skyblock coin and this was the answer? Judgment core. Okay, of course. Wishful thinking. Don't don't say it. I'm just gonna accept I'm not even gonna look. Yeah, yeah, okay, dude. Man just trading me like the most expensive item in the game. <laughs> Has anyone ever got one of these in contraband? I can't bring myself to sell that, especially with the state of every Hyperion on the auction house right now. What I have to do is sell off my Astraea and turn this into Astraea and have all three of the best Chimera 5 Necron blades. I think that's the strat. Oh, that's it. That's the boy. Oh, that reminds me of something that I got to do real quick. 19 mil. That's so expensive. Okay. Second master. Fourth master. We need those for our Terminator boy. So that can go in the Terminator bag. We got to do a floor seven in a bit with Terminator and the aspect of the void. So I can actually show what I was going to title this video about. Because now this is going to have to be like a different video entirely. I'm telling you. Why is the Terminator so broken? It makes a Chimera 5 Hyperion look like it's pure garbage. Like you're there in M6 with a Chimera 5 Hyperion. Right click spamming. Doing everything you possibly can. And things still take two or three hits to die. And you're very squishy. Terminator, you don't even have to get close. You stand far back. One shot everything's dead. I'm actually going to play Archer. Can you believe it, boys? Now we can go to the hub and place our bid. We, we definitely have to place our bid now. This one, 10 minutes, 47 seconds. Yeah. A nice, cool 827 million coins. Man bids me again. Yeah, yeah, 900 mil. Yeah, bring it on, dude. 900 mil. I'm going. Oh, this is already 100 mil more than the highest one that's ever sold ever. Oh, and there's someone else. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Watch this, man. I've just bid like one bill on a judgment core. I'm definitely going to drop one now because I will never sell it for anywhere close to that. <gasps> oh, Pocket Express. I thought it was a judgment core for a second, man. I saw a big block. I was like, <gasps> what? <laughs> I'm suffering from success. That is actually the same chance as getting the judgment core. I'm actually getting so lucky, but so unlucky with this at the same time. I don't know if I feel good or bad about this. I was fully expecting to be outbid again. And you know what? I wasn't. We take that, man. We take that. That's a dub. Terminator is mine. I can finally stop getting bullied. People will finally want me in their dungeon teams. You know what? I feel a sense of relief. Judgment Core, Vicious Five. Thank you very much. All right, let's get everything out of here. Unfortunately, the worst part about this craft is that you have to quick craft it. You can't actually go and make the bow because you can't stack the Ender Pearls and you can't stack the Null Blade. I hate that Hypixel. Why have you made me do this? But Finally, my boy. 
Terminator. Thank you, seriously, to everybody that helped out with this. I appreciate it. That Judgment Call cost me nearly a billion coins. I want to give this thing its own video. This thing deserves its own video. But for those of you that haven't seen it at all, I'll do a sneak preview. We'll play Floor 7 because then you only get to see a little bit of it against Necron. And I get to show you how broken this is in Floor 7. Next stream, we'll use this in Master Mode. In Master Mode, this is something else, bro. All right, let's get these things out, man. We got to max this boy. So what we need, basically, if you look at how this weapon works, it's really weird. It divides your crit chance by four, which I guess is their way of kind of balancing it. So what we actually need is the hasty reforge. We need as much crit chance as possible. I don't know what else we really need. I'm thinking of putting my dungeon talismans on unpleasant. Oh, talismans don't give crit chances. That's true. You just use CC enrichments. We'll give that a try then. We got to go enrichments, accessory enrichment swapper, critical chance enrichment. Been a while since I maxed out like a proper good weapon like this, man. Putting the enchants on is juicy. Like the last one was this, but it didn't feel right just putting one for all on it, you know. But being able to max out a weapon like this, this is sexy, dude. I'm loving this. fourth master star and finally i think it's maxed out i don't think this can get any better i think this is our boy the terminator the most broken item to ever be added to this game and now i've made it i'm almost certain they're gonna nerf it like immediately let's try e-drag just out of dungeons real quick let's put a warden helmet on actually what mob do i want to test this against the only problem is i don't have 100 crit chance outside of dungeons which is unfortunate but you know what 385k and what i shoot three per left click and i can just spam it you know what i'm gonna try it against the ghosts i want to see what it's like against these things see if this makes them actually doable you can't shoot them with it pog champ <laughs> That's very anticlimactic. Because apparently the diamond heads are now so much better than warden helmets as well. So I'm like, my comparison video is just pointless now. Do I want a solo archer? Could I solo for first? Yeah, I'll clear with the bow for this first one. I'm ready to be blown away by Terminator. It's very overkill for floor seven. But don't worry, chap. The only reason we're using it for floor seven is because I want to save this for master mode for a future video. Because this just has way too much content. I'm mainly going to be showing you the aspect of the void in this with how broken the TPs are. It's going to be an experience. I'm ready, bro. Archer Fraction. This is cursed. You all have waited to see this for the longest time, bro. This is overkill for a Shadow Assassin Floor 7, man. I missed every single shot. That is that is most unfortunate. 41 mil, is that? Oh my god. We have no blessings. We have, we have nothing and I'm doing 50 mil. And it shoots three arrows, bro. This is beyond overkill in floor seven, man. Oh, clearing in master mode is going to be gorgeous. My crit chance is 90%. Ooh, I might need to get that up a little bit more. Let's see what blood's like. Everything's just dead. All right, if you guys thought that was mental, do you want to see what else this is like now? Yeah, the, both of you, you see that? You can just uh, teleport in the floor seven boss room now with the air TV ability. <laughs> it's, it's mental. <laughs> I guess you can just TP straight to the pad as well. Oh, this is the part where we need Jerry Sheen, actually. I forgot that was a thing we'd actually need. No more parkour in this anyway, by the way, chat. You can just instantly TP over everything. I'll, I'll just go straight to two bottom. No more jumping in the lava, boys. No more worries. We'll get this terminal over here. Actually, yeah, I won't need the Bonzo staff anymore. That can disappear. I don't think Nebula is doing you know what? I can solo too now. You can just whip about the gaff. It doesn't even matter. Let me solo at mid. I want to try soloing Necron at mid. Actually, I could just TP straight to mid, right? <laughs> I'm not even using Wither Scatters and I forgot to swap pets. Oh, it's so stupid. It's so good. I love it. Now the boys are going to show me some more broken air TV things. I am so ready for a man. You completed a run without blood? All right, show me. What is going on? I don't like the look of this man. Oh, he's Bonzo staff. Oh, yeah, the Bonzo staff is still useful. What are they doing? Are they trying to get in the wall? Make these ghost blocks? Okay, we got ghost blocks. But I kind of don't really have anything to Bonzo staff off of. Bonzo through and TP onto the bedrock line with Ether Warp. I'm going to suffocate to death, bro. I want to get this down, though. Maybe if I make another hole here. Fairies and... Uh-oh, do we need fairy open? Or is it because Average wants to get respawned? This does look sus. Oh! All right, I did the thing, but yeah, we need fairy room, it looks like. Okay, I see what they're on about. We want to TP onto that bedrock line, right? Yo! 
What? <laughs> oh my god, this is sick. Where do we... Why am I dead? Death box? Ah, I see this would have been useful information beforehand, boys. I can't lie. Do I respawn on them? Oh, I do. All right, sweet. Wait, Necron's here? Wait, we're at the boss? What he's going, he actually doesn't take damage. How do we do this? <laughs> How do we kill him? <laughs> All right, where do we go? Oh, I'm dead. I died to the death barrier again. You hate to see it. You have to shadow fury. Oh my God, these guys are doing some funky stuff. Necron's just facing through walls, you know, nonchalantly. Yeah, I guess this is actually the boss room. I think average is in. Yeah, average is in. Cal Spirit. Leap. I am very dead, brother. Why does the boss start if you glitch into the boss room? That is so weird. Here I was hoping they wouldn't patch the other wall, but when the boss fight is reduced to this, yeah, they're definitely gonna patch it. This has to be the weirdest bug in Hypixel Skyblock like ever. I think the ability you can TP in the boss is so sick, but yeah, this is unreal. The thing is, obviously being able to TP in the boss fight, it seems like a bug, right? Because normally you can't TP, but TPing at the map, that seems sus because you can use the 60 block TP anywhere in dungeons. Like it's designed to work like that. Otherwise, it's a bit of a scam item, right? Find a stair and stonk through it. <gasps> a red name stonk. He's found a stair. Ooh. Oh, so you're saying, wait, go all the way from this stair here, then through the wall. This is some next level bug abuse, bro. What he's going... <laughs> I hit a death barrier, bro. <laughs> All we need to do is get to that bedrock line. <laughs> nah, it's it's not happening, bro. We may as well restart. Just got here. What's the strat? We're trying some illegal tech, man. Don't, don't even worry about it. Don't even worry about it. Very illegal tech. Oh, pork champ. Leap, boys. I did it. I got out the map. Let's go. All right, where do we go from here? I need to learn where we go from here, man. Can you just TP up to the top of this? There's no shot. That's more than 60 blocks. No way. All right. Average fan Necron apparently. I think this is the first phase of the boss fight down there. All right. Where do we go from here though? That's the question. Oh, he's just sporting with a skeletons. Okay, then. I don't know what's going on anymore. <laughs> We're in. Aspect of the Void is actually the most broken thing in the game, bro. This is, this is unreal. This is actually unreal. This is definitely more than 60 blocks. What do you guys think about being able to TP in the boss fight? It's a cool concept, but my God, do they need to patch it? Not even patch the TPing in the boss fight. They need to patch this weapon, bro. Like, this is just illegal. Is LTS still worth it? Yeah. LTS is a solid weapon, dude. Both for Revenant Slayer and just because it's, like, a sick weapon. Like, all right. No looting. We are good players. There we go. We did floor seven the cool way. You can actually still loot that chest. Just at seven, minus 745k anyway. But there you go. You actually still get this chest. That's weird. <laughs> that's cursed. But anyways, boys, that's the aspect of the void. Expect the item to be disabled sometime very soon which is sad because it's pog next video i'm gonna be trying this bad boy out but in the meantime i'm gonna be playing with it off stream because it's just bellissimo dude it's just bellissimo wait this gives you 60 attack speed in dungeons you don't even need strange talismans once again massive shout out to everybody that just gave me like everything this stream you guys are cracked i hope the ranks are mild and are enough and for real like i have no words this might be like the most amount of contraband ever gotten in one stream ever see i could overtake swavy if I really wanted to, really wanted to. But yeah, leave a like, subscribe, and I'll see you all soon. Peace.